Welcome back to the Mortgage Marketing Update. I'm Brian DeMarie. I'm a loan originator with Union Home Mortgage and the DeMarie Lending Team. So let's look at jobless claims. Initial jobless claims are people who are filing for unemployment for the very first time. Those numbers are up from last week. Continuing claims are people who have been on the system or in the system continuously. Those numbers are slightly down. And when we look at the pandemic unemployment assistance and the emergency claims, those numbers are also down respectively as well. Um, so although we're seeing this slight improvement, we do know that that stimulus package is going to get approved and that these uh, packages are going to be reinstated. So the folks who have come off are most likely going to come back onto it. So keep in mind, these systems don't necessarily incentivize some people to get back to work. Of course, there are some people that are hurting and they are in need and they do need this money, but there are other people that are going to make more money sitting on these systems than they would if they went back and got a job. Furthermore, tomorrow we get our BLS, Bureau of Labor Statistics, jobs report. It's one the big one that we get once a month. And we're expecting really modest numbers here, less than 150,000 for the month. And so, you know, if we're going to get back to normalcy at all in this country, it's going to be because people are getting back to work. Uh, and we're looking at these numbers so carefully because people that are on unemployment are not allowed to use that as a source of income to qualify for a mortgage. They have to have a job. Remember, if they're using FHA and they've been out of work for more than six months, they have to be back to work for a minimum of six months before we can use their income to qualify them. So looking at U.S. savings rates, it's the percentage of income that their people are actually saving. Uh, in December, it was 13.4%, but it's gone up in January up to 20.5%. Maybe it's because of Christmas. Who knows? Uh, but it looks like from the stimulus money that people are getting, 20 cents of every dollar is going to goods and services. Where's the rest of that money going? Other places like Robin Hood and DraftKings of all places. So I don't know how many of you have been keeping up with this, but in 2022, Google is going to be getting rid of all cookies, all third party cookie, all third party cookies, all of them all together. They're going to be moving towards something called Flock, a federated learning of cohorts. So this is basically just large groups of people that are grouped together by their browser history. And so this is supposed to be stored on our browsers, not in cookies that's going to then transmit that information. So then Google can take it and sell it to third party advertisers. So this is supposed to be an anonymous way of tracking. And they're doing this because they have gotten themselves into a huge privacy PR scandal uh, because everybody knows that they're tracking us and people are starting to speak up a little bit more about this and nobody wants to think that that phone that their computer their ipad their apple tv that all of these things are a hot mic just recording everything that we're doing transmitting it to a, a data file somewhere and it's being sold uh so I think that, you know, there's, it looks like they're still going to be reading our emails. They'll still have access to other things. So they'll know how to track us and know how to send advertisers to us. But at least I guess this is a start where we don't have third party cookies happening. They'll just consolidate all of this under one umbrella, which is alphabet. When you come across somebody that wants to get pre-qualified for a mortgage, Lily and I want to be your number one first and only destination for mortgages easiest way to send us over a lead is to text us over the buyer's name and phone number if you want to do a three-way text message introducing us that works as well we call that the white glove handoff and then we will reach out to them get them pre-qualified and then follow up with you all of these videos are backed up on youtube all you have to do is type in my name check us out on instagram talk to you tomorrow who's to say what's impossible will they forget this world keeps spinning and with each new day I can feel a change.